Yo, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. And today we're going to be doing a bit of catch up, if you will. If you couldn't tell already, I haven't posted on YouTube in like, I think a week or so. If you don't know, I'm a photographer and videographer. So I've been doing lots of gigs left and right. But aside from work and shooting videos and editing and doing all that kind of stuff, I installed a few new things recently. My homie Josh bought me a bidet in experience, to say the least. Here we go, here we go. It was an experience. We're gonna hop into some free for all. I know a lot of the time I'm doing a lot of search and destroy and stuff like that. One game mode that I've always played and that I've always had a love for. Wait, no, not like this. Not like, not like this. I, I like free for all just because of the fact that it's all by yourself. I think Phase Rain did that to me. Just trick shotting last and sniping to last. Actually, funny enough, the game before this, I hit a trick shot. So I'll show that real quick. Bro, that was you. Okay, I was about to end this too. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew it. Somebody. I knew it. I told you. Oh, he got it. Oh, good shit. Yeah. If you didn't know, I have been a photographer for I think eight years at this point. Give me the quad. Give me the quad. I've been a videographer for like five. But yeah, that that's basically what I've been up to the last week. Not, not a day goes by where I'm not thinking about posting on YouTube. I'm trying to do it more frequently sandwich and i still did it with a VTOL. come on i want to post them every single day trust me but your boys gotta pay the bills you know what i'm saying um but aside from that i'm pretty sure i'm gonna be having a ninja diffuse video in the next probably like two weeks or so like like my fully edited ninja diffuse videos only reason why i don't do them too much is one i have to i have to collect all the clips for it and two they take a long time to edit i'm pretty sure the last time i did one it took me 26 hours so I, it, it's it's a hefty little edit you know what i'm saying Bro. So you have TikTok in your clan tag and TTV in your name, bro. Alright, we made it to last. Cross map for the one time. I'll take that. You know what I'm saying? I'll take that. God. Nice. Oh, back to back stinkers. Okay. I have been using the Razer Wolverine Tournament Edition controller for quite some time. I know a lot of people play on PlayStation controllers, but me personally, I've always played on Xbox. So I kind of just like prefer Xbox. But at the same time, I have been testing the market when it comes to controllers. I've had scuff controllers. I've had Razer controllers. I've had normal Xbox controllers. When my controller breaks, that's like my cue to buy a new controller of a different brand. So for the most part, I've just been testing out like all sorts of different brands just to see which one holds up the best the one that i like the most the controller that i picked up last week is a xbox series 2 elite i'm pretty sure it's called i know it's a very well known but after seeing the elite controller um it looked like it had everything that i need so i picked it up at best buy and i've been using it for like four days or so at this point and so far i love it if we're comparing it to like the other controllers that i've had the build quality of the series 2 is impeccable it feels like a a, a durable controller you know it doesn't feel like a like a little puny piece of plastic in your hand the only thing that i don't like about it so far is where the paddles are placed they're not in like a bad spot but this controller it forces me to use my ring finger which i've never used to uh, click paddles before it's always been my middle fingers like on scuff controllers i'm pretty sure i'd use my middle finger for both of them and the razor wolverine it has two mechanical buttons on top which i prefer if i'm being honest that's my favorite oh no, i'm sorry bro Damn, I have a lead, 20 to eight? These guys are terrible today, bro. Like, I don't even think I'm like smashing it right now. I'm doing like mediocre. Oh, Lieutenant Dan! Lieutenant Dan! Still got a lead though, so I'll take it. I mean, it's I have a crazy lead, but at the same time, I only have three and a half minutes. Alright, I'm at last, baby. I'm at last. That's how we do it. I really want to hit a backdrop. I haven't hit a backdrop since, like, Black Ops 2, bro. No, 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 no. You don't want to do it like this. Yeah, like that, like that, like that. I'll take the dub. Still at a 10 kill lead. That's crazy, bro. And I'm at the top. And I'm at the top. And I'm at the top. I'm at the top. Bitch. You dropped 19. You what are you talking about? Oh, I also got a Go XLR. That's cool. Bam. I got one of these bad boys. Again, I've used this for about five days, maybe a week or so. And it is amazing, bro. I had no idea that your boy needed a Go XLR so bad. I want to be honest though. Free for all has just been my home the past few um, days. I've been editing, filming, and playing free for all. <laughs> That's about it. Also, high alert is your friend in free for all. If you haven't like put two and two together, people spawning behind you every second of this game mode, you need high alert, bro. 
All right, kill one. And we at last, baby. Oh, Gary, right over your nose. It was just a 360, but like, I'll, I'll take it. Three trick shots in one video so far? Bro, we on fire. Like, actually on fire. Free for all just got the lobbies right now. Oh, no, not like this. Behind me. Oh, but about four days ago or so is when I completely wiped my PC. Uh, all my OBS settings reset, all my game settings reset, so I had to start fresh completely. But I've been turning this computer on every single day for the past like three years, and it hasn't had like a proper clean. Chalet, you're dumb. I have like a tiny lead right now. I need to like lock it in for the one time. Hey, bud. Certainly not. Alright, we got 23 to 17. Not a terrible lead, but not a good one. Oh, I mean, pistols. Not like that, dude. Oh, my. Lobbing it. Oh, imagine. I know I've said this. Hey, yo, hold on. I'm not going to lie to you. That's pretty crazy. By the way, Ghirardelli chocolates, bro. Dark chocolate with the sea salt caramel. Oh, well, let's fucking go. I got my Call of Duty to work on my Chromebook. I'm proud of you, bro. I'm proud of you. Sir. Yo, what CPU does that thing have? If I know this. It's the lowest I've got it from my school. I'm probably gonna catch about five frames, but it's good. The past month or so, I've been trying to get a ghost sponsorship. The only reason why I was promoting ghost was because it's a smaller kind of like energy drink company, kind of. Also, they're partnered with FaZe. So I was like, you're always trying to get into FaZe. They're partnered with Ghost. I mean, uh, you, you, you connect the dots. So the more and more I drink it, you can like, it's hard to describe, but it tastes like a very heavy energy. Damn! It just tastes like a very heavy energy drink. Like you drink it, you're like, you drink it, you're like, dang, this an energy drink, you know what I'm saying? Kind of like punches you in the mouth with caffeine. The low recently has been really promoting Juvie, and I've never really heard of Juvie up until he started promoting it. I'm pretty sure, I could be wrong here, but I'm pretty sure it's in like California or LA only. And conveniently enough, they're starting to test it out internationally. One of the places that they're testing right now is Detroit. Conveniently enough, yeah boy lives in Detroit. So um, it's at 7-Eleven only. I bought like every single flavor so I can try it out and post content on it. And it blew my expectations away. I just think the best way to describe Juvie would just be like a light energy drink. It's nothing like, the flavors are there. The, the flavors are very flavorful, but the caffeine doesn't like punch you in the mouth like a ghost does or like a, like a monster would, you know what I'm saying? You trick shot in mid games, bro? What are we doing in mid games? What are you doing back here, homie? I don't even know you can go that far back there. Um, I will say nothing will beat the flavor of a Red Bull, bro. Maybe I'm weird, but I just, Red Bull's got that unique, unique taste to it bro it's so good i will say the only benefit to this map is trick shotting you can go for such long range and distant stuff because of it oh he was there too but i think i'm gonna end it there i'm pretty sure we hit three trick shots so that's pretty sick let me know down in the comments if you want to see more free for all if not maybe i'll dabble a bit more in search and destroy but that being said hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out baby